hey guys welcome back to my channel it's marisa in today's video we are doing a double unboxing from magical folk first we have the garden seance tea box and then we have this gorgeous box shadow of the divine feminine both by magical folk i'm really really excited so let's get started Hey guys, I am back. So this is my first double unboxing. This again is both from Magical Folk. So we are going to start off with the Garden Seance box. This gorgeous box and we are going to move that one out of the way. That is basically a goddess box. This is gorgeous. This is Musings for the Hedge Witch. And the box is just uniform all around. It is giving me Alice in Wonderland vibes. Always just a gorgeous packaging. That's the bottom. Really beautiful. This is the second box. So this is a very, very new box. And this box is $20 including shipping. We're just going to put it on top of here so you can actually see. Because I am back on the floor. And so we have some paperwork. That's what it looks like when you open it up. And by the way, it comes in black mailers, both of them. So you can't see anything. It's totally private. So here she gives you a lot of paperwork. So this is the Dragonfly Spirit. Okay, but it's going to get spoilers. So we are going to put that aside because I don't want any um, hints. All right, so. In this box, you get three teas. All right. So, first tea is Witch of the Rose, green tea. Gorgeous packaging, Witch of the Rose, and it's green tea. Beautiful. And here is the back of it. If you want to pause it, it's kind of hard to see still for me. I still didn't get my glasses, so it's a little hard to see. But it is beautiful, beautiful packaging. Candice, I love it. I love this box. I think it's gorgeous. And I'm really, really happy with it. I'm glad I subscribed. This is a subscription. And this is what the tea looks like inside. Gorgeous, bright, vibrant tea. I'm going to smell it. it. Smells really, really fresh. And you get quite a bit in each uh, bag. So let's push that back a little bit so you can see it her packaging that she chose is absolutely gorgeous i really love it so the second one is the jasmine pearled green tea so we have another green tea and there's some information on the back there if you want to pause it and let's open her up and I'm going to show you what it looks like inside. I don't know if I've ever had pearled tea before. And this is a little hard to open. I got my nails done. So, yeah. Hold on, guys. And this is what it looks like inside. Oh, these are really, really cute. Very, very cute. Look how fresh it is. And it smells really good. I love me some teas and you could do these ice too. You know, you can just steep it and then you could add ice afterwards if it's like too hot for you because it is summer. All right. And we get one more tea. And this one is Dragon's Eye Vanilla Blooming Tea. I am really excited about this. Here is the back of it. Again, with the gorgeous packaging, vanilla, yes, vanilla blooming tea, beautiful. And I'm really excited because I don't think I've ever, I've always wanted a blooming tea and I never uh, had one before. I never tried one. So let's open her up. One second, guys. Sorry. The little packaging is hard to open. Let's give me a second. It's a little hard with the nails. And here we go. Very, very cool. So you get two of them. Wow. This is really, really, really beautiful. Look at that. So I'm assuming you put this in water and this opens right up into a bloom. Beautiful. 
All right, and then the last thing we usually get is like a tea. Um, and there's the back again. Vanilla blooming tea. I love this dragon's eye. I think that's really, really cool. All right, trying to stand her up there. Not, not wanting to stand. All right. Sorry, motorcycle. I don't know if you can hear that. And so the last item, we always get like a tea accessory. I believe last month she gives a beautiful Labradorite and we got a little charm. Um, it was the ladybug. So let's see what is in here. Now this is a tea ball strainer with for loose teas, obviously. I do have one, but this is, um, has some charms on it, which looks really, really cool. So let me just take off all this plastic. And just letting you know, this is a voiceover because, you know, there's a lot of people in my studio apartment. So I really wanted to get this uh, video filmed for you guys. It's been at least a week and this is how I could do it. I have to wait sometimes where there's a little bit of quiet. So here are the really cool charms. Look at this. Look how cute. I mean, is this can be any cuter? It is a little silver teacup. Look at that. How adorable. And a little teapot with a spoon. Oh my God, this is adorable. And what does that say? It says, drink me. So there it is. Alice in Wonderland vibes. I knew it. The, like the aqua and the packaging is so freaking cool. So we are going to look at the paperwork next. I really, I'm really loving this unique uh, tea ball and all the teas are so freaking cool. So let's, and I love the little um, sachet. All right, so here is the paperwork. So we got the Witch of the Rose green tea, Dragon's Eye Jasmine Pro green tea, Dragon Eye Vanilla Blooming tea, and the tea ball infuser with charms. And we got the full grimoire, uh, download, which includes rituals and all that. So the Dragonfly spirit represents resolute self-knowledge and unwavering authenticity in light of transformation and spiritual evolution. As a symbol of vibrance and individuality, the Dragonfly is the environment of fiercely showing your true colors. So what else do we have here? We have associations and correspondences, season, summer, element, air and water, goddess Freya and Ixchel. Oh, I can't pronounce it, sorry about the stones, herbs, themes and intentions, spiritual symbolism, uh, dragonfly totem, teaches redefining yourself, personal conviction, living your truth, living with authenticity. So much information about the dragonfly spirit. Then you have new moon, um, what do we have here? New moon ritual, cleansing ritual, more cleansing ritual. We have the Garden Seance, let's see, what's here? Garden Seance Ceremony Guide and another page of the Ceremony Guide. So she gives a lot, a lot of information. Look at that beautiful paper. I think it's really, really gorgeous. Look at that, just beautiful. So I am in love with this box. Again, it's $20. So I'm gonna put the link to her website in the description below, alrighty? So on to the next box after this one. So I love this and I have a link for the Garden Sands uh, site as well. You can join the discussion. She gives tons of information. She has her own app.
Hey guys, so here is the next box. It is the Shadow Path of the Divine Feminine. So this is what it looks like. Absolutely gorgeous, this aqua again, but it's aqua and black. Have these beautiful turquoise feathers right on top. And I have a feeling this is the box I really, really, really wanted. So let's get started with opening this up. So we have the two feathers, two beautiful turquoise feathers. Very, very nice and really beautiful size. Love it. All right. So let's push that back. And of course we have our paperwork and it is the goddess Ma'at. I love her so, so much because I have a, a tattoo of her. So here is the information on this beautiful paper. And they give, she gives so much information. So I have a tattoo and here it is right here. I got this a long time ago. I absolutely love my art. All right. So first item we have, it is called Rise Herbal Blend. So right there beautiful i have quite so it has um lemon balm blue vervain ginger root grapefruit peel all right that's what has in there let me just adjust this camera a little bit sorry and you get quite a bit in this uh package and the packaging is a little different and i have no idea what this is so let me open it up All right, I have never seen one of these before, so please, someone tell me what that is. Is that a great, a greater? I don't know. I'm silly. I have no idea what this is. Please tell me, Candace. Please, in the comments, if you watch this video, tell me what this is, or anyone out there, tell me what this is. Is that a greater? But now I'm just thinking about it. All right. So the next up, we have. A beautiful black sachet okay let's open her up it's really tied tightly so give me one second guys with the nails it's always a problem they look pretty but it's hard to open stuff beautiful absolutely gorgeous look at that wonderful how pretty is that i love it absolutely good so we'll see what um it is in the paperwork absolutely gorgeous look at that i'm gonna put it on right now because it is too beautiful not to wear okay and by the way guys this box is 43 dollars and here we have our beautiful goddess candle, Ma'at. Beautiful. I love it. I love her candles. Candace, you do an amazing job. Look at how gorgeous this is. I love aqua. This is so beautiful. So um, this has Amazonite crystals and Heka anointing oil. A blend of spice mocha and peppermint creates a peaceful, familiar ambience to both honor inner truth and rise to absolute truth. Beautiful. All right. What is next? And her oils, her um, tinctures, the candles, everything is made by her. So this is Rise uh, Beauty Oil. It has so much in here, guys. Um, allow the sacred creative feminine force of the entire universe to move freely through you. So beautiful. I'm opening it up. It has evening primrose, camellia seed, pomegranate seed, um, rose hip seed, apricot kernel oil, let's see, Roman chamomile, geranium, and divana or divanya. Devana. 
there is so much in here and she gives a lot of information but we'll go our, over that at the end and i'll read a little bit about ma'at and then we have the um what is this yes the rise crystal infused yoga meditation mist so i'm gonna spray it because i love all her it smells so good it has hydrangea blue lace agate meditation mist will bring you peace foster balance and promote alignment with cosmic order and i think that is it that is it for the box okay so here is the paperwork like i said she gives you so much information um the goddess ma'at had no had no temple she reigned both where truth order and harmony ruled and where it was needed most no matter how we start goddess ma'at can be a patron of our inner temples allowing integrity balance and absolute truth to reign as such the un undeviating ma'at is a guide to priestesses who are ready to uh, descend towards cosmic alignment or to be rescued from the chaotic abyss and she gives so much information about chaos and order ma'at at the, at the right order life and death ma'at at the measure of the heart ethics and morality ma'at the twofold path so this is absolutely gorgeous paper and there's so much more guys it would take me like an hour to read everything and then of course in the back she gives sorry a little um code and you can download a lot more information all right so we have the ritual tools and we went over some of that already so we have the um devotional candle it also has coffee grounds and um what else and peppermint um coffee grounds and powers uh burn as an offering to ma'at during a ritual for self-compassion and forgiveness and then this i still don't know what it is exactly like i said please candace or anyone in the comments uh let me know in the comments what you think it is all right so this is the oil and uh let's see has all that information like i said and there was another thing Ra raven sara in the very bottom and i'm not sure it clears the mind and focus on magical intent it promotes courage and helps overcome fears and anxieties so it has so much information and all the different uses for it okay and then this is chrysocolla the chip bracelet right there chrysocolla is a blended stone of malachite and azurite if i'm saying that correctly it empowers feminine energy a stone of the goddess and those who resonate with it will likely feel her ancient and enduring energies rising within chrysocolla helps one learn how to live from the truth of the heart all right and the feathers of course these are ostrich turquoise ostrich feathers and of course, Ma'at is associated with the feather. Um, the beautiful pale turquoise ostrich feather symbolizes higher truth and the lightheartedness it brings. Weigh your heart against the feather, receive the good gift or forgiveness. Okay. And then we have the Rise Crystal uh, Yoga Meditation Mist. Unlock peace, power, and purpose of your inner truth. Our hydrangea and blue lace agate meditation this will bring you peace foster balance and promote alignment with cosmic order spray your yoga mat or blanket uh, with the crystal infused reiki charge mist create space encouraging presence for anxiety relief and freedom from stress and the burden of worries beyond your control deeply enriching for both uh asana and prayama i can't say that <laughs> all right and of course the rise herbal blend which is gorgeous <clears throat> and then it also she gives um instructions how to make your own tincture and what i also love about this box i don't want to forget 
is like every month you get you get something a little different you always get a candle but sometimes it's a tincture sometimes it's an oil um, sometimes it could be a spray uh, it could be a tea or herbs but she does give tons and tons of information guys and i love it so that is the boxes let me know what you think about the boxes like i said the tea box is totally new this is the second one um, I love the goddess Ma'at. She is one of my favorite Egyptian goddesses here. Is all the box laid out. Beautiful, beautiful packaging. And just the energy coming off of it is just wonderful. And there is my foot. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So that is the box. So let me know in the comments what is your favorite item. Um, again, I'm going to have the link to magical folk and also i'm gonna have a link to the garden seance so she created an app for the garden seance okay and that'll be in the description below it is a wonderful community and yeah so you know we can contact each other and um that is it guys so don't forget to subscribe hit the notification bell i'm really really happy to be back and I hope you enjoyed today's video. Bye.